What's good, y'all? It's Elik. So today we are playing Hayes Peace. We are going to be doing a giveaway. Link in the description if you want to get in that for a devil fruit. Yes, we are giving away a devil fruit, guys. But let's go ahead and get straight into this video, man. Codes out, but let's go ahead and see what we get. Yo! Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that's a common. I don't know why it was rainbow for a second, guys. Um, Let's go ahead and see what we get. Why'd they troll me like that? Off rip? Elf. Is Elf good? Why is it showing it rainbow at first like it's some demon clan or something like that? Mink? Okay, what, what's a mink? Okay, we got an uncommon, guys, but we're gonna go ahead and grab some codes and see if we could get anything better than this. But, I mean, at least it's an uncommon. We get 15% walk speed, jump power, and stamina, but that's not good enough for me. We need that mythical, man. Alright guys, so we went ahead and spawned in and we're gonna put in some of the codes. I believe this is the first one. Hopefully it's not expired already. And we successfully redeemed and it doesn't even tell you what you get, which kind of sucks. But we're gonna go ahead and get the next code. So guys, we have another code, which is 145k likes for next as well. And I don't think it tells you what you get out of any of them. You could look down here and try to find out, but so far it doesn't really tell you. So we're going to go ahead and try Wowzers 125k. Go ahead and redeem that success successfully redeemed. I don't know what any of this gives you just yet, but I do know for a fact that we are going to get a couple more rolls so we don't have to stick with this mink race. Alright guys, so there is another code which all capitalized is group only, but you do need to join the Haze Peace Roblox group. I'm not going to be doing that right now, but it does give you 10,000 cash if you really want to go do that. Go ahead, join the group and redeem that code, but we're going to go on to rolling our race once again. Alright guys, so it looks like they give you rewards based on how long you've also played the game. I mean, I just joined and I'm able to claim two of these and they are already i got a fruit obtained a mysterious fruit okay so is that this right here what is this i don't even know i'm letting you guys know disclaimer right now i am not too familiar with the one piece anime guys so i might get a bunch of this wrong but i don't know it just has spikes on it is this like a bomb fruit or something Alright, y'all, so it looks like from the codes that we used, we actually got 10 spins. Let's go ahead and see if we could get something better than just a mink. Hopefully, we could at least get a rare, maybe a legendary. Mythical doesn't sound... You could get human again? Wow. Alright, guys, come on. Can we get something good? Human again. Why? I don't understand why it turns rainbow. Like, they just want you to get hyped for nothing. Three-eyed tribe... And it's a common again. Come on, guys. Fishman. Fishman is also an uncommon. You get swim speed. I wonder if I should be a fishman, guys. Because can't um, Devil Fruit users not go in water? Like, they'll drown. So would a fishman be good? Y'all tell me. I'm going to go ahead and roll it because I do want to get a rare or a legendary. But you guys let me know if I sold the bag right there. Let's see, uh, human again. No buffs. Imagine rolling all of them. Oh, Lunarian. What is this? Yo, we got a legendary, guys. Let's go. One Skywalk, 10 health regeneration, 25 jump power, and 10 stamina. And we got some cool wings and fire behind us. Yo, we got a legendary, guys. This is a good start for this game. I'm liking it so far just because I got a legendary. So, guys, we are now level 5, and as you level up, you're going to get stat points. I'm not going to throw them in just yet to combat or anything because I don't know if we're going to have a sword or if we're going to find a fruit. So, we're just going to go ahead and take our time, and I did end up losing that spiky fruit that I had. All right, y'all, so I guess we were doing this wrong by just fighting. We need to go ahead and actually get a quest so we can level up as fast as possible. A group of thugs are terrorizing our village. Please help us get rid of them. Those ones are locked because we aren't level 10 or 25, so we're going to go ahead, do the level 1, and kill them. All right, y'all, so you just want to go ahead and kill four thieves to get our first quest done. I don't know if it changes quests every single time. But I'm assuming you had to do this for the very beginning of the game. We actually leveled up four times just off that one. 
which is pretty crazy. Let's go ahead and find out if we get a new quest this time. Let's go ahead. A group of thugs are terrorizing. We can do the level 10 one now, guys. And then, obviously, we're going to go ahead onto the 25th. So, now we have to kill 24 bandits this time, guys. For 4,000 XP, which is pretty crazy. Alright, guys. So, literally, by the spawn, we're going to go ahead and go and get a sword, guys. For 1,200 belly since we've been grinding. We have 4,000 right now. And we have obtained a katana now. Which will hopefully... Yeah, we get new moves. Air Slash and Lion Song, y'all. So now we're going to go ahead and do these quests over and over till we get to level 25 to do that quest. Alright guys, so what you want to do to get these quests done really easily because they honestly are trash. Just hit all of them and round them up so you don't have to go one by one guys. This is a little cheat code to get these done way faster so we can get on to the next quest we have. Alright y'all, we are now over level 25. We're gonna go ahead and take this new quest to fight the bandit boss y'all. And if you want to know where that is, because I don't know why they didn't put checkpoints in this game. But you need to go over in this area in order to fight him. And we get 18,000 XP. Let's see. Oh, he's already low. Go ahead and just take him out. Go ahead and just take him out, guys. I mean, I thought it was gonna be a heck of a fight, but does he like power up? Yo! Wait! Oh, it didn't count. Maybe you need a certain amount of damage in order to actually get the XP for it. At level 40, you can explore new islands, so that means we are probably done with the quest here, and we can move on to the next island, guys. Alright, guys, we're gonna go ahead and head to the dock and buy a sailboat, and off to a new island we go. So guys, it looks like you just want to head straight to get to the next island and we're gonna find somebody we can get some quests from and level up really fast. So Alright y'all, if you want to set your spawn point, go ahead and talk to Nami. She will be on every single island and you want to set it because if you die, you literally need to take a sailboat back all the way to the next island once again. So make sure you're setting your spawn point every single time guys. So now we made it to the next quest giver guys we want to get from level 40 to 60 now by just killing the clowns over and over we went ahead and upgraded our stat points for the sword for now until we do find or roll a devil fruit this is gonna help a lot especially when you go from island to island so i'm not gonna end up just saving them instead we're just gonna go ahead and do this so guys, if you end up saving 50 gems, we are at 48 right now, but you can actually spin for a devil fruit. You won't have to find one under a tree. We're gonna go ahead, take the nether quest, and it is the clown boss. I mean, there's only two on here, but yeah, so far we're leveling up really fast. See, okay, I can beat him. Alright guys, so we actually got three levels off of that. We get 57,000, or was that, I think it, yeah, 57,000 XP. Alright guys, we've just been searching around everywhere looking for a fruit. You had to look under a ton of trees. Honestly, don't even know where it would be though. And oh, we got one right here. What, what kind of fruit is this? What kind of fruit is this? I don't know what it is. We're gonna eat it, guys. I don't know what it is. Was it fire? Is that magma? It's a heart. Wait. Oh, we got it. Room, radio knife, gamma knife. I don't know what it is, guys, but we got it. All right, guys, so after some asking around, we got Law's Fruit because we have the room, which is like the domain expansion thing. Like I said before, I have not watched a ton of One Piece, guys, so don't quote me on any of this stuff, but I'm pretty sure this is Law's Fruit. So guys, now that we did get a Devil Fruit, we're gonna go ahead and use our refund token and put 190 stats into our Devil Fruit for now because we do have this and we're probably not gonna need the sword anymore. And I'm pretty sure Lost Fruit is probably good from what I have seen in the anime. Once again, I have not watched all of One Piece, so don't come at me, guys. We have a little bit more stamina and we'll just keep the 27 points for now. But let's go ahead and try our moves out. The let's see. Wait, isn't it fruit stat? I can't use any of them. Yo. All right, guys, we just used the room move. I don't know. 
Oh, do I need to be in the room to use the other move? That makes a lot more. Yo, this is broken. This is broken, guys. Let's try B. This is crazy. So it, they have to be in the room. And look how big the room is, guys. It's like the entire map. Can I not use B? Oh, my God. This is actually crazy. Did we get one of the best fruits in the game? All right, guys, now that we are level 90 and we finally got a fruit, we're going to go ahead and do the quest on, I think, is this like the Fishman Island or something like that? I'm not sure, but we're going to go ahead and do this till we get to 120, guys. Guys, this fruit is actually insanely broken, bro. Like, they're not even killing me at all. I probably don't even have to set a spawn point, maybe for the boss, but... It's actually, look how big the room is, bro. Look how big the room is. And yeah, it is confirmed, guys. This is Lost Fruit. All right, guys. Now that our free XP did expire, we're going to go ahead and claim this one now. So we have the new timer on. And we get a whole nether hour for double XP, y'all. All right, guys. I don't know why, but this guy just asked me if I wanted the snow fruit. And I went ahead and took it. I'm not going to switch over because I believe mine is better. But we're just going to go ahead and throw it in our bag. I also didn't even realize we got the clown nose from the boss on the other island. And it gives you 100 health, which is actually pretty crazy. All right, y'all, we are now level 120, and we're gonna go ahead and fight the shark boss, you guys. Let's see if we can take him with the room that we have now, with what we have, and... Bro, he doesn't even move? Does he not even move? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, this is light work. Oh, my God, I didn't even see my health. I did not see my health. All right, let's go ahead and get back into it. Oh, I didn't even spawn the room. All right, we got it. And we leveled up two times. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. We still have 40 minutes of XP. So as you guys can see, I think we just went from level 90 to 120 in less than 18 minutes, guys, which is actually pretty insane. Guys, I got the shark blade. I think it's a 5% drop. Let me go ahead. Let's go, y'all. We got the shark blade. I'm not sure how much better it is or anything, but... That's actually pretty fire. It has two moves. Shark Hurricane and Shark Smash. Level 150 and 50. Let's go. We got a 5% drop, guys. Okay, guys. So you need to be level 160. I went a little too far and became level 172. But you want to go ahead and head to the next island. So I think we're going to have to go for level 200 after this. And as you can see, we can keep claiming our prizes. We got another stat refund. They're actually feeding us good with these. It depends on how long you really play the game. So once we get 12 more hours, which I'm definitely not going to get that, we'll probably get something good. But I'm pretty sure this is the next island we have to be at. So guys, for the islands you want to go to, you want to go ahead and click on the map icon and it'll tell you what level you need to be to get to the next island. And you can get up to level 1,900, which is actually insane. I don't know if I'm going to be playing this game enough to get there, but y'all let me know if I should really grind and try to get to that island. Okay, guys, you want to talk to town girl Diana, and now we are on the road to level 250, guys. Guys, do not forget to set your spawn point because I'll- Alright guys, we are now level 200, so we're gonna go ahead and fight the level 200 boss, guys, and get to 250. It is the bomb boss. Alright guys, so he's already half health, so we're just gonna go ahead, destroy him, and put him in a pack real quick. Honestly, I don't know. It might be my fruit, but I'm actually going insane. And we just got times 2 XP, 528. So did we get a million XP for that? We leveled up three times, which is actually insane. And we have seven minutes left of our double XP, guys. All right, y'all. So with using our double XP from the beginning, we get for free. And from the code that we used, we were able to get to level 232 and to get to the next island we need to be 250 which is honestly pretty good for two hours of gameplay
Okay, guys, so we are finally level 250, and we're gonna go ahead and go to the island over here, which is the last island we're gonna go to for this part of the video. This is a part one, guys. We will be doing a part two. Wait, is this the island? Why does it look like a bow? Hold on. All right, guys, do not forget to set your spawn point, and as you can see over here, we can actually buy black leg for 50,000 belly you guys let me know down below if i should buy black leg for 50,000 belly but we are going to be doing a devil fruit giveaway link in the description if you want to get in the discord and join that let me know do you guys want to see more haze peace content i will be dropping a part two so make sure to smash that subscribe button y'all have a good one i'm gonna see you guys in the next one it's elixir peace